Coming up on this episode of Naya TV, Jason Shrek Dietrich, Queen of the Range. What? I get my bush biter out. What? And Brad and Shrek talk about the Ruger long range target. The LRT. It's awesome. So this is Brad, this is Shrek. <laughs> it's almost Christmas, but we've managed to sneak in one more episode of Naya TV. Joshy, roll the bumper. Welcome to Naya TV, the show made exclusively for Aussie shooters. I'm your host, Matt Williamson. Now, look, Shreky, where did you go, mate? Come on. You went to see the QRA 2022 Queen's Prize. Ah, oh, the Queen shoot. Yeah, see, look, the way Brad explained to me, a little bit different. <laughs> G'day Australia, Shrek here for Naya TV and I'm here at the beautiful Queensland Rifle Association Shooting Complex in Belmont. We're here to see the state championships and the running of the 132nd Queen's Prize. How are you Sean? Jason, good to see you mate. I'm the manager here of the QRA Q store. So we are a target shooting supply business that our game is to support and supply a product to the target shooting community. Lapua Brass is the favourite. Yes. It's quality premium product. Yep. And we do sell a lot of it, yes. That's, that's yep. great. We're here at the firing line of the Queen's Prize. I'm here with the chairman, Andrew. Nice to meet you, mate. So tell us, what's the QRA stand for? What's it about? Queensland Rifle Association. Uh, we've been incorporated since 1861. I think we're the oldest incorporated sporting body in Queensland. Wow. We're predominantly um, involved in long range target shooting mm -hmm. um, or traditionally full bore shooting. Yep. But in the last probably 10, 15 years, we've also moved into F class, so scope shooting. Uh, if someone wants to come and try shooting uh, and try this discipline, how can they get involved with QRA? Sure, easy. It's just a matter of getting on the QRA website. Yep. We've got a come and try event here. Yep. Um, you know, giving it a go. After that, we've got opportunities within clubs located here in the, in the Belmont precinct. One of the things about long range target shooting is it's probably the most inclusive sport we have in Australia. Yeah. Doesn't matter whether you're able, disabled, male, female, young, old, we all compete on the same level playing field. It's a sport for life. You know, I got busted up pretty bad playing rugby. Sure. And been there myself. This is, this is where <laughs> this is where I am now on the mound, you know, yep. and I've been shooting for nine years and um, the worst injury I've done is a bit of a broken heart. <laughs> <laughs> G'day everyone, we're here with Shane. He's uh, the previous winner of the Queen's last year in his discipline. Welcome to Night TV. Thanks very much, Jason. Well, I grew up in Warwick. Um, my dad uh, introduced me to shooting. Moved to Brisbane to go to university in the early 90s and uh, joined one of the clubs here at Belmont. And oh, wow. I've, I've shot here basically ever since. I've shot TR the entire time and I'm yep. um, still loving that. So yeah. I find it a great place to come on Saturdays and relax. And the, the yep. club mates are great. All the people at the range here are great. So just a lot of friends. You do see a lot of families. There's a lot of families out here. Well, the mouse told me you had some success yesterday. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Um, Things went my way. Okay. Um, it was pretty pretty windy at times and handled that okay. So, Is that a, well, um, Shane, good luck for the rest of the event. Thanks very much, Jason. Thanks. All right, well, look, mate, it looks like a great day. Who won? Marty. Great guy. Uh, I had an opportunity to present him the trophy. The uh, guys at uh, Queensland Rifle asked me to do that. Yeah, really beautiful. Enjoyed it. Met lots of the winners. Uh, lots of great people, all shapes, sizes. You know, this sort of thing's gaining in popularity more and more. Where do they go to find out more? Dub, dub, dub. <laughs> QLDRifle.com or please see the link below. So after the QRA shoot, we decided to head out to the boss's property and shoot the Bushmeister. Hey fellas, how good is the Bushmeister? Awesome, it's unbelievable. Awesome. Oh, hey, hey fellas, how good is the champion Wheelie Bird 2. Oh, it throws me to next week. So. Jeez, Mate, and or, hey, 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 fella, how good was my shooting? <laughs> well, a bit better than Shrekies, maybe. What?
The Bushmeister BAX12 has been on the market for probably about a year. They are rugged, tough, and built exclusively for the Australian conditions by one of Turkey's leading manufacturers. Now there are five models to choose from. The Bushmeister Tactical, the Bushmeister Marine with a modern stainless Cerakote finish, the Bushmeister Walnut, the Bushmeister Synthetic, which is also available as a combo, and the Bushmeister Camo. They do come packaged with these little rubber, rubber stops. Once you've taken the end cap off, pull the bolt back, it'll lock in. All right, so move the fore end forward, place your barrel down, make sure she's lined up, slide it down, that's it. And just screw that up, making sure it's nice and tight. There we go, simple. And all Bushmeister BAX12s come with the following features. Five chokes, five shot magazine, three shims or spacers that can manipulate the cast of the stock for a left or right hander, hard case with gun socks, one inch sling swivels, and a drilled and tap receiver for a scope base. To say that the Bushmeister BAX12 has grown in popularity is an understatement. Its unique inertia operated bolt action has very few moving parts, which means it's extremely reliable. So, how does it work? Essentially, the Bushmeister BAX12 is a lever release shotgun. Unlike a conventional lever system, which operates like this, the lever release on the Bushmeister is located here, on the receiver. Now it's important to make sure you use the right type of ammunition for this shotgun. Due to the Bushmeister's inertia operated bolt system, it's important that you don't use low recoil or trap loads. Ely Alpha Max 32 Gram BBs or Remington Buckshot or Federal Game Shock are great rounds to use with the Bushmeister BAX12. So today I have with me two versions of the Bushmeister BAX12. <laughs> I, don't know what, I don't know what he's doing mate. <laughs> hey Shrek! We're just, we're just trying to do something. So today I have with me two versions of the Bushmeister BAX12. This is the standard walnut version with a 28 inch barrel. Don't forget it comes with five interchangeable chokes and has a five plus one magazine capacity. Righto Brad, hand that other one over mate. <laughs> oh look at this! This version here is the Bushmeister BAX12 Marine. So the Bushmeister Marine comes in two configurations, walnut and a synthetic stock. It also comes with five interchangeable chokes and has a five plus one magazine capacity. The best thing about the Bushmeister BAX12 range of shotguns is that they are backed by Naya with a three year warranty so you can go your hardest. So here we are, we're out on a property on the Southern Downs, got something else I want to show you. This is the Champion Wheelie Bird 2.0. It's got 2.0 in the name so you know it's going to be good. In fact, the Champion Wheelie Bird 2.0 has had some pretty serious upgrades. These include built-in cord wrap to securely store your cord, a wireless remote and foot pedal, quicker motor which gives an ultra-fast 1.75 second cycle time, solid tyres for easy transportation, and throws targets up to 75 yards and has a 50 clay hopper. As well as the handy foot pedal, it comes with this nifty remote which has up to a 15 second delay, which means you can use it yourself because it's wireless. So Champion makes a wide range of electric traps that can accommodate any shooter. And the Wheelie Bird 2.0 continues its reign as king of the air. The Bushmeister BAX12 and the Champion Wheelie Bird 2.0. Two great products, we've got plenty of them. Get down to your local firearms dealer and get one today. Ruger American Rimfire LRT is quite simply awesome. Awesome! To tell you all about it, I have a couple of industry experts that have the knowledge and expertise to tell you all about the features. Unfortunately, Ken and Bushy weren't available. You've got the B team. Take it away, Brad and Shrek. Welcome to the Naya TV Ruger Special. This is the Ruger American Long Range Target. This is a great little 22. It's based off their Centerfire platform. You can also buy this in 6.5 PRC. Three in a Win Mag, Creedmoor, and 308, I believe. Correct. 
So we just thought we would give you a run through. This is a great little rifle. It's good for comp entry level competition work, things like NRL 22 and other precision matches. And we've been down there testing this afternoon and we've been hitting everything we've been pointing at. Yeah, yeah it's, really uh, impressed. Really accurate. Yeah. It, it's got a great heavy barrel on it. You, you're looking at a 22 inch heavy barrel there. The typical Ruger proprietary. Uh, and it's got Ruger's great proprietary 10 round rotary magazine, which is always a hit with hunters and shooters. Oh, the easiest to reload too, isn't it, Tricky? By far, by far. It's got a Ruger Marksman trigger in it. Again, it's an adjustable trigger. It's got that safety blade type system that we're used to these days. Uh, you've got a large bolt handle for those uh, quick cycles, makes it much easier. It's got a 30 MOA rail on this. Adjustable cheek piece. Adjustable comb has spaces in the back of the stock that gets that length of pull perfect and it's got a nice little feature here to, to help you ride a rear bag should you want to and yeah look we've topped it off with the bushnell prime 3 to 12 by 40 fantastic scope for rim fires um, not only rim fires air rifles as well parallax adjustment down to 10 yards which is fantastic we shot it off the spartan valhalla bipod too attached to the picatinny rail adapter that, that spartan do supply it is just a fantastic competition rifle competition rifle a little feature here that I think it really brings this, this LRT into its own uh, is this M-Lock rail. So all those guys out there that have M-Lock accessories, it, they're so popular in the market right now. You could put peak rails on it, you could put M-Lock to M-Lock stuff on it, you could put bipods, you can put sling studs, you can put anything in the M-Lock these days. So come here ready to go. Something else I forgot to mention earlier when we were talking about the stock, it's got the flush fit push button studs. Tactical, yeah. for tactical slings, yep. Uh, and here's one in the back ready to go. As Brad said, we shot this earlier today. Take it away, Mr. Cameraman. Be ready. Send it. Get it ready. Bit of wind out there. Hold left edge of the target. Get ready. Send it. Woo! So there you have it guys. That is the Ruger long range precision target. Tell you what, there's only one place to go and find Ruger. That's at your local dealer. Correct. So jump in, tell them Brad and Shrek sent you, and they might even give you a smile for the trouble. <laughs> and just remember, anything that we sell, if it's, if it's a product offered by us for sale, comes with the best backup service and warranty in the country. Absolutely. This is Brad. This is Shrek. And thanks for watching the Nia TV Ruger Special. special. Oh, hang on, I forgot to do this. <laughs> <laughs> well, fellas, I can't believe it. we're at the end of another season and another episode of Nia TV. Mm. We'd like to take this opportunity to wish you and your family a very Merry Christmas and a happy and prosperous New Year. Stay safe out there. What are you laughing at? <laughs> What do you laugh at? <laughs> we'll see you next time on Nia TV. Is that right? Was that the equal of yeah, that? Equilibrium, that's a bit better. Shrek out. <laughs> can, you, can you say it? Can you salvage anything out of that? Yeah, you've got a box or something to stand on? We have a bushy box. We've come to the end of another season. 2020, 2020, yeah. 2020. 2020. There, have a very safe, happy, and prosperous, merry. <laughs> Start that again. We think you need to say Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year again. You can say it right. He said it four times wrong. Merry Christmas. <laughs> a very happy, safe, and <laughs> a very Merry Christmas. <laughs> Still stuck in the process. <laughs> <laughs>